Yes, I'm heading back to Honduras If you won't come back and be mine I don't have any answers for your questions. I don't know why I do the things I've done. Haven't got a single thing to tell you, girl. The promises were broken. Everyone. So I guess I'll head back to Honduras. Be with amigos of mine. There's work to be done. Gotta lay in that sun. Sort out these memories of mine. I guess I'll head back to Honduras, the mountains, the islands, the wine, Tegucigalpa, San Pedro Sula. A man could lose track of the time. The nightingale calls from the forest, but I know she ain't got a dime. I'm heading back to Honduras. If you won't head back and be mine. Excuses are wonderful creatures. I use them whenever I can. This evening I can't find any. I feel like a stark naked man. But destiny calls and you answer. She says, boy, you're cursed, or you're blessed, but you better slide south of the border and give that poor romance a rest. Well, when Leo was released from the penitentiary by the expedient of giving the city an ambulance, He decided that he would uh, dedicate his life to fighting corruption in Honduras. That would be his mission. The only problem was that there was too much corruption for any one Italian. And he decided that the Supreme Court of Honduras was also corrupt. And to point that out, he went on a hunger strike. And when a guy who owns a radio station goes on a hunger strike, but his hunger strike, while well, it weakened him, uh, didn't really slow him down. He went to functions all over town, luncheons, but he didn't eat, meetings. And he was carried to these meetings on a litter by four of his friends slash employees. And if you were having a party to Goose Gap, well, that's exactly what you wanted to see. Leo on a hunger strike on a litter carried by four people entering your party to essentially rain on your parade because he's fighting corruption. And he's here fighting corruption Wherever you are, in your face, it's fighting corruption. Well, the uh, hunger strike got old. And Leo realized that he would need his strength if he was going to fight Honduran corruption. So he moved into the Holiday Inn in downtown Tagus. And it's a very hilly city. It's, it's hillier than San Francisco. And uh, out of his front door at the Holiday Inn, there's a very steep hill. And as Leo was restoring himself to health, part of his physical training was to run up that hill at 6 o'clock in the morning. One day, as he was uh, restoring himself to health to fight corruption, 
Corruption fought back. He went out to run up the hill. He went up the hill, two men went behind him, ran up behind him, and shot him in the head. So my friend died, fighting corruption, in an odd country we both loved. <laughs>